Good morning, super cool party people, and welcome back to the vlog. It's super windy, so I don't know if you can hear me, but I got up early. It was Monday to go for a walk before my staff meeting, but I need to turn around and head back <laughs> before I mess it. Well, it's just about one now. That staff meeting dragged and dragged and dragged. It was almost a solid two hours, which normally we're much better online, but there was a lot to discuss because November is pretty busy for us. But I have since eaten lunch. I made my bed look and like you can see my floor. It's amazing. It's a miracle um, what, what happens when you deal with your clothes. Um, anyways, I just have a vlog that I edited exporting. That was another thing that I did. So like I cut all the threads on my scrunchies while I was in my meeting. And last night I transferred all my footage over. So I organized it and then I got a vlog ready to go. And then, um, yeah, so I think what I'm going to do is once this is finished exporting, I'm going to upload it. I'm going to jump in the shower because I leave the shower. I'm gross and stinky. <laughs> and then I'm going to probably play a little bit of Mario for a while because I deserve it before I get into um, cutting like a million masks. I need to figure out exactly how many I have that I need to cut. I just know it's a lot. I can... <sighs> Like I can probably do them in batches because I have one order that's for like 10 masks <laughs> and like she's totally chill with waiting for them and getting them sporadically so like that's great and then I have like five other ones so I have about 15 masks to cut which is a lot because you're cutting 15 masks and you're cutting 15 liners plus I also have to fix my template because it's slowly beginning smaller so some of the masks are smaller than they should be so yeah fun times anyways so yeah I think if I have a shower and then just um play some video games for a while I'll feel great I think it's finally starting to rain yeah so I'm glad I got out earlier for a walk because I was gonna text my friend and be like hey do you want to go for a walk even though like I've already gone for one but I'm like it's supposed to pour rain like you can see it's getting windy too so fun times anyways that's where we're at I've been super productive so far this morning the majority of the things are crossed off my list and like honestly once I shower I'll just be cutting the masks, hopefully sewing the like nose pieces together and then vacuuming and dealing with my jars up there. You can't really see them, but they're all there, which means I don't have one to bring tomorrow for work. Anyways, I'm going to go because now I'm rambling and I'll check in with you at some point. <laughs> okay, so I am out of the shower now. It's actually been a while. I think it's three o'clock. So I showered and then I laid in my bed chilling and playing Mario Galaxy while I air dried and now because I'm just the queen of procrastinating it is time for hot chocolate but even better than just hot chocolate as is wait for it is hot chocolate with some vanilla ice cream in it <laughs> this is like the way to do ice or er, ice cream hot chocolate it is way better than whipping cream, in my opinion. Also, this like ice cream has been in here for a couple months, so I don't know how successful we will be. Yeah, look at that. That looks amazing. So I'm going to consume this because I cannot cut fabric while I consume this. Rats. And um, I'm gonna check, see if there's anything interesting on YouTube. Otherwise, I'll just roll straight into starting watching Supernatural. And then when I'm done this, I will start cutting those masks. I, I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna get them all cut today. We'll see. If you could see how precarious my camera is positioned at the moment, it's fine, I think. As long as I don't touch anything, it'll be okay. Anyways, it has been quite some time. Shocking, I know. It is currently 9.30. I got some mail today, which is super exciting. A letter, a very 
delayed Christmas update from my friends from last year as well because um return to sender because I guess I just didn't give her my um new address it's cool and I also got my Canada Post small business card so that's really exciting basically it gives me discounts to send stuff in the mail it's like all official that's exciting Alrighty, so, and when I say so, I mean like actually so. So, I cut out all the masks and the liner, liners, linings, and I sewed them all together around the nose bit. I've got these guys here because that's the next step, but that is definitely a tomorrow job. I can see it there. The plan tomorrow, allegedly, <laughs> apparently, is to sew the nose pieces and to pin all the masks together. And by all, I might not do them all because that's 19 there and that's a lot. One, my friend has ordered like 11 from me. So the majority are hers and she's chill. Um, and then there's one for me too, which is exciting, but yeah, there's a lot. Uh, <laughs> and then I had a lady that I work with at the theater text me today and ask me if I have any poppy patterns and I don't, but, I'm going to Fabricland, I think, tomorrow anyways. So if I can find some, then I don't know how many she wants. She said she wants a couple. So yeah, that's just another couple to add to the list. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> so my masks. I also, I can't remember if I mentioned it, but I modified the pattern because it was slowly shrinking. Let me see if I can find. So this was this one that I was using for large. As you can see, it says not large <laughs> because it is no longer large anymore. Um, so this is the new one I have. It's a little bit bigger. I don't think it's like too, cr like holding them up together. You can barely tell the difference, right? So it just feels a lot larger to me, but it could be because I've been kind of, like I said, slowly trimming that one away. And so the masks have been getting slightly smaller and slightly smaller. Like I think it's only like maybe a quarter inch difference from the original to the like last one that I made. But for some people that makes a huge difference. Fortunately, I have a tiny this part of my face, so they all fit me no problem, but yeah. So they're bigger, but again, I almost feel like they're too big. So what I think I'm gonna do once I get everything sorted is sew one of the ones for my mom's boyfriend because if it's giant, that's fine. Um, and if it's not, then I'll be like, okay, we're great. Anyways, that's where we're at. I need to tidy up my room a bit. It's not so bad. I just have thread there because I was getting out the thread. I have scrunchies in the middle of the bed there. I can never, there it is. And then my agenda there, nope. Oh, the letters, my agenda's right here. And then I just have to clean up my ironing board from off the ground because I will not need that for a couple days now, I think. And yeah, so tomorrow if I can do the nose pieces and pin them, and then I just wanna cut a ton of elastic and fill up my drawers. And overall, I think it's okay. So I'm gonna stop <laughs> rambling now because oh, I've been rambling and I'm going to pick everything up get everything sorted and I'm actually pretty tired which is impressive considering it's only 20 to 10. Like fingers crossed I can go to sleep early. Like hopefully all this walking and working out, uh, all I'm doing is walking. Anyways, hopefully all this has made my body be like, hey, let's sleep. That's the goal. Anyways, again, stop rambling. Alrighty, so I think that's it for me for the night. I'm in my jammies and I'm about to climb into my bed. I'm either gonna watch something or maybe play a little bit more Mario Galaxy, but it is quarter after 10 and I'm gonna try to get to sleep by like 11.30. That'd be great if I was asleep before my phone was like, you can't have any of these fun apps anymore. Yeah, so that's the plan. And thanks for coming along on today's adventures and I will see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night.